With Dave catching up on work and releases flying at me left and right, the usual Friday wrap-up has been delayed. But fear not, for I have something just as good. A hands-on preview. Let's not beat around the bush here. Punch Quest from Rocket Cat Games owes much of its DNA to that of Jetpack Joyride from Hearthbrick Studios. That said, what's on offer is a distinctly different beast, even if it does fall into the rather broad auto-runner category that has been a near constant on the App Store for a long time. However, Punch Quest gets it. From the instant you load up and hit start, the game starts blaring at you with colourful explosions everywhere, enemies flying left and right almost in deference to your blind and pathetic stabs and the basic two-button controls, and you feel as though you've hit the jackpot without even trying. You're sucked right in, and Punch Quest keeps you locked onto the screen as you explore not only the wildly strange, side-scrolling beat-em-up world it inhabits, but the many tantalisingly priced upgrades that beg you to try them out. As such, I feel as though I've only scratched the surface of what's on offer. Whether it remains just as addictive several hours later is a question I'll have to answer. But even if not, as long as it remains just as appealing, be it through providing a depth of challenge to overcome or similar, to play in short bursts, I'd say it's a success for fans of the genre, and of the studio in general. We'll have our final verdict ready once the game goes live next Thursday, the 25th of October. Don't forget to like and subscribe to show us your love, and if you're out there in Twitter or Facebook land, you can find us there too. Have a great weekend. This has been Andrew with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.